my Saturn view when they think they're going to get, because I had ignition switch done. Look, I paid for it. So if you think you're going to steal that car, steal, if well, yeah, I know you stole it. You stole my SUV, my Saturn view that I paid $48.74 for because I had to get an oil change and they were, the ignition was recalled. When it probably shouldn't have because they freaking messed with it anyway. So it said replace ignition lock cylinder. Replace ignition lock cylinder. Right here. I did it. This is mine. I did. Go figure. Two years before. In two, this is 2015. I had this done. And then you decided you wanted to, you wanted to get into that class action suit. So you decided to pay some asshole to fucking hit me. Good job. I wonder how much those bitches got paid to hit my car in Glassboro. How many, how, did any of those cops get a piece of that money? You got your money, Palilio. Your little niece has been fucking with my son too much. Well, not lately. But she messed with my son in 2013, and she stole my son's um, Xbox game controller. Good job. Me. Me. Did you guys steal my a copy of the Power of Attorney and then with my signature on it? Huh? I just wrote on it. Okay? These assholes think they were going to steal this blank power of attorney. See it? Power of attorney with my signature on there. It was blank. I just now stuck because this was a copy from Nissan in 2000, uh, Nissan in Turnsville. The Nissan dealership in Turnsville when Nick Nick's What's his name? Nick did something. Somebody stole my, um, somebody stole the, the cards to it. I was looking for the, the cards to the Nissan dealership. The, the manager, the finance manager, Nick. Mustach, must, mustachio or something like that. Magistachio over at Nissan dealership in Turnersville was the one who wrote everything up. All this stuff up. Everything. Nick did. He's the one that wrote all this stuff up and then charged me $1,900 for um, a service contract. Good job, Nick. I'm glad that $1,900 you guys were able to pocket that money. Uh, meanwhile, good job. Okay, my car. My Saturn view that they paid some asshole to hit me, to steal, so they can get a piece of the million dollar ignition switch. You don't have the original document. I got the thing fixed. So any of you assholes in the state of New Jersey who think you're gonna get a piece of that money, I hope the defense lawyer for Nissan dealership fights you tooth and nail for that fucking money. I hope Nissan and any car dealership has the best litigation lawyers ever. I really do. Because you're not going to win. And if it was up to me, I'd be working that case. But I like organized crime. I like to, I like to uh, 
bring down organized crimes, criminals, and I want to bring, I, I, I do like insurance, the, uh, to bring down insurance fraudulent people. I mean, I'm real big into that, and I'm real big into the, the, the organized crime units, too. So, but, uh, You will go down. Everybody does. Everybody gets busted eventually. But like I said, they want this file bad, and I won't let it go out of my sight. It is not. You're going to have to beat me up and kill me for my file, for that file. Don't worry. If I have to, I'll kill her. I'll steal the whole car if I have to. You already did. You stole every one of them. I had seven cars they stole so far. Seven cars they stole. Greedy? Yes, they're greedy. They're very greedy. They rip, they're trying to go through here and rip all my paper so they can steal out of it, it looks like. I need to put this back together again. I need another five folder. But I don't want a folder like this. I want an envelope. I don't want a folder. I want an envelope. Now, I saved envelopes somewhere, but I know I got some type of envelope somewhere so that I can put it in. Sugar. This ain't big enough. I don't have a big enough envelope. Praise God. I got to. I gotta have one. Right, what's mommy gonna make for dinner? Hmm? It's my SUV car. My SUV. You see? You will not get this one, that's for damn sure. This is the receipt from when I got my tags. Good through May 2016, I had. Good job. Good job, losers. Now this is the... Back in 2014, when my husband took that loan, out for the car, it looks like. Yep. Application date. Go figure. My husband, I get into a car accident in 2014. My husband went straight down, sh straight down to uh, one main financial and took a loan out and bought himself a piece of shit car. Yep. That's what he did. My husband, I got into a car accident April 3rd, 2014 with my Jeep that's in my garage that's not going nowhere until I put somebody behind bars for it because you're greedy. And he, my husband went out next day and took out a loan. Here's the application loan. Credit application. Yep, I own my house. 
purchase date. He put January of 2003. That's when we moved in here. I bought this house in July of 2004. Another falsified document. Whatever, I don't give a shit. He's like, yeah, nobody cares. My husband got hired at Edom Foods ja November 11th, 2003. He said he got hired in April 2003. Department head. Melissa was the loan officer. She's the one that signed everything. But, um, Melissa Richardson. Hey, I just got an email from some Kevin Richardson. Melissa Richardson is the one who's been given, that gave my husband a loan. And the girl that came here to my door Looks exactly like, kind of like the girl that was at, at the, or that, um, at that, that, that. Let's see what happens. Truth will be told, one way or another, you'll be found out. Yes. Yes, you will. Meanwhile, I'll sit here and I'll praise God and I need a new envelope. I can't find one. I'm hungry. I want to eat. I can't find one of my stuff. So Nadine, I'm sorry. Wait, let me break that plate. And now come fix the plate and see if that's fit. See if we can fix it. You broke me and my children. You broke the, everything good that was about me and my kids. But guess what? God's going to restore everything good that you stolen from me. Now I'm going to go, I'm going to read and study for the next hour. Because I got homework to do. I'm going to do another, I'm going to read and study for the next hour. Because I've got school tomorrow. My kids are off from school. Truth be I'm told. School for yep, for Monday. the next five days. Amen. Monday. For the love of God, I am and will always be faithful to my Lord and Savior. God bless. Take care. Truth be told. Thank you to the world. Good luck. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you to all. Man, class was awesome today. Man, I, you know, I've, I get so pumped when I learn. I loved it. The class was freaking awesome. So awesome. I just want to know. I can't wait to get in the field. I'm not a cop. And I won't be a cop. I'm too old for that. I don't want to be a cop. But I do want to investigate. I want to do the paperwork. I want to type up the stuff for them. You know. I want to be able to research them, people. Thanks. Wish me luck on my job searches. Obviously, I'm not working for the mail company. So, whoever, is work, whoever stole that job, you will go down. I am not working. So, yes, I took the, I took the post office test. I took the exam, and I passed. But it wasn't good enough for the person, whoever won it. I guess whoever the hire, it wasn't good enough for them. So, but that's okay. They wanted somebody else. I wasn't ready for it anyway. So, when they offered me the, the thing, 
All right, peace, love, and happiness. So if anybody's working in the post office at my, with my name, you will get found out, and I hope they lock you up and throw the key away. Thanks. Many prayers. Good luck. Be safe. That's all I ask is for you guys to be safe. May the angels watch over you.